<laughs> yeah. Pull up in the light. <laughs> Hi there, everybody. I'm the Missing Sock. Welcome back for more Grand Theft Auto Online. Late night in front of Bowling Brook Penitentiary. <laughs> so today we're going to talk about how to get yourself the uh, medals paint jobs unlocked. So the main way to do that is with the rally races. So you might wonder, how do I find rally? Because I wondered that, but it's a really dumb question because it's, it's easy to find. <laughs> Some of you guys might have already laughed because you know how to find it. So it's quite easy and uh, I've already done that. So I'll kind of show you guys that. Now, one thing about this unlock is that it does not pop up. It just happens. So you just go to the, uh, the LS customs or some kind of mod shop just to confirm that the metals is unlocked for you. And uh, that's that. Now, under metals, there's gold and brushed gold, and that unlocks at uh, level 100. And the other ones, the, uh, the aluminum, the uh, brushed dark steel, they require being unlocked through the rally races. Oh, we got somebody coming by, driving by on the highway. That's right, keep going. <laughs> so it does help to be on a public session filled with people. Okay, um, it doesn't, you know, you don't need to be, you can do it from an invite only session, but uh, I find it helps with the invites, you know, because it sends out invites to all the people in the session, plus the whole world at large. It just seems to be easier to launch these kinds of things when there's a lot of people on, but you can launch them from invite only or a session all by yourself. And it should still invite other people from around the, uh, the uh, GTA universe out there. All right, so let's, uh, let's launch it and I'm going to show you guys how to do that here. So I've already done that here and I'm going to show you guys the race that I did for that. Let's see. So you go to a pause menu in the enhanced edition, go to your jobs, go to play job, and go to Rockstar Created, and go to races. Now any race can actually be converted over to a rally race. So that's really cool. Now I'd recommend one particular race does stand out that people recommend, um, that I recommend too. <laughs> that's criminal records right here. So this one's nice and easy. You just go around Bullingbrook. So let's click on that. Yeah, I'm sure I want to start that job. Now, this is literally a race just around Bolingbroke. And these races um, are the same under Rally or Normal. So let me just load it up and I'll show you what I mean here. Okay. Uh, I guess the radio... Oh. No. No. Ah, I guess we're in the race. But that's okay. You guys get to see the race. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so this is the race criminal records. So pay attention right now. You, this is not a rally race. This is a regular race. And all it is is just a lap all around here. Looks like we're going to do a few races. But all it is is just a track right around Bolingbrook. Nice and easy. Simple. So, rally races are usually require a minimum of four players. So you need a navigator and a driver. And that means you need four players. Two navigators, two drivers. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, even though that looked really mean. <laughs> it's just racing. Racing's rubbing. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, yeah, so um, you need two navigators and two drivers in order to run a rally race. So it does need to be an even number. So six players, four players, eight players, um, something of that nature. Go. Woohoo. Now that can be a bit of a pain to set that up, as you guys can imagine. The good news is that you can run a rally race um, without knowing. Like so, so sometimes people launch into, they join up with races without knowing what's going on, and nobody really wants to do a rally race in general. But if you pick a rally race on criminal records, um, you can still see the targets. So normally the navigator on a rally race, the, tr the passenger, is the only one that can see these targets, and the driver cannot see them. And the rally race, you have to use your headset and microphone or the keyboard, um, the controller to, uh, to make arrows show up on the driver's screen to tell them where the race is. So to go left, go right, go left, go right. Right? And it's a bit of a pain doing that. Uh, you definitely need a headset. But the good news is, a way around all that, doing an easy rally race, is just to go to Bullingbrook here, just to do criminal records. And then if you can't see and your, your uh, passenger isn't giving you instructions, it doesn't matter, All you know the drive. So pick driver and then just go around like this. And that's that. That's all there is to it. 
Window. Woo. Oh, yeah. Hurt. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Sorry, didn't see you there until it was a little too late. Wow, it was looked really cool. I ain't bad. I'm just driving here. <laughs> you uh oh. Put your hands up. Uh oh. That guy's wanted. I can't Help believe it. <laughs> Where'd he go? Oh, look out, man. Run. 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 Yeah. They're coming after you. <laughs> yeah, kind of. You're kind of. You, you got plenty of time. Pl plenty of time. <laughs> I can't see him. Yeah, no. You guys really suck as a police force. <laughs> All right. <laughs> So welcome back everybody. So uh, I thought I'd just quickly show you the uh, the uh, race, you know, um, with the uh, the targets on, and um, with the I don't know checkpoints on. I guess you could say, yeah. So you just load up that ra race like we were just doing. Online jobs, yeah. Pause online jobs. <laughs> just making sure nothing's going on there, and then races, and then down to your criminal records. Now hopefully this time I can launch it and get in there alone instead of joining other people. Okay, there we go. So let's see, host. Let's see if we can get in there. Okay, so right at the top of the list here, guys. See in the top left, standard. So that's where you want to change your race to rally. Isn't that easy? So I couldn't find rally race anywhere. It's kind of, kind of dumb that I forgot to check there. So yeah, change that from standard to rally. And then I would suggest in our criminal records, if you're just unlocking it for, um, uh, for medals, change it to number of laps one, probably supercars, but whatever car you want. And that's it. And then you have to wait, unfortunately, for people to join. So you confirm matchmaking open. It doesn't really matter about the other settings, as long as you're set to rally race. And there you go. You need at least two players for the rally race, which is interesting because, you, you know, with two players, you really can't do the rally race. You actually need a navigator um, to do it, right? But this actually shows that you it will let you, the game will let you run it with just two people. You don't need four, despite what I said. So you need four to run it right, but you can get away with two. So what you would do is you'd already have to know the track because as driver, you're not going to have any navigator. You won't be able to see the checkpoints or see the track at all. And if that's the case, you basically need to, uh, to, um, uh, um, we know the track ahead of time, you know, sorry, I just had to think about that for a second, but yeah, you have to know the track ahead of time. And thus, this is the great way of doing it. Level seven probably doesn't even know he's about to unlock it. Odd, it's letting me do it with just two people. <laughs> so this lucky uh, rank seven should actually get his um, his thing set up. His uh, his uh, medals unlocked for this. Yep. So I'm just gonna run in it to do him a favor. So guys, that's all there is to it. So a little bit broken up. Hopefully you guys can understand that. Just run the race, set it to rally type. And then as soon as you get another person, and I'm trying to show it to you rough so that, you know, a lot of players don't know what's going on. They just kind of join up. And uh, it doesn't really matter. Like he's just given me his first instruction. <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't really matter because as long as we're good. Yep. See, like that's the point to the criminal records is being it's a nice, easy track around Bullingbrook. You don't need to see it at all. All right, that's all there is to unlocking the pan, the metals paint job. Ooh, rank up to 418. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> all right, now I'm going to drop back in. And I'll quickly show you guys um, the metals. Hopefully quickly drop back in. <laughs> I 
Woohoo! Okay, everybody. So here we are back near Bullingbrook. Now we're gonna head right over here to the uh, to the uh, LS Customs to Franklin's Garage. For those that remember that for the single player, this is the garage that Franklin could buy. Room. And just a closing, just to show you guys the medals. I'm sure a lot of you guys already know, but you know, some people may not. So just to make sure you know what I mean, and to show you that it actually works, we'll go in here and show you medals. So I wanted to get this unlocked. I've got some what future cars um, that I'd really like to use medals for. And as an easy example to, to let you guys know why you might want medals is uh, the Deluxo. Um, if you wanted a DeLorean that looks like the Back to the Future DeLorean, you almost kind of need the uh, medals unlocked. Let's repair. You have any problems, you bring her back to me. And then we're going to go into uh, respray. I'm a little blind at the moment. There we go. Respray. Okay, primary color, and there's our metals right there. And as you guys can see, it's now all unlocked. So the uh, the pure gold and brushed gold, you unfortunately need rank 100 to unlock. But these ones here, as you guys can see, item unlocked after winning a rally race. So we've done that. I've now run uh, one, two rally races, I think, <laughs> but with helping him. And it's a very cool look. Look at that. That's not an awesome look. I think I'm going to keep my original uh, copper there. But that is uh, that is nice. Yeah, I think my original brown is uh, the brown that you've seen me driving around in is a uh, maple brown with a uh, gold pearlescence, I think. But this would look awesome too. Look at that. That's just awesome. Yeah, so I wanted to unlock the metals and um, to do some future videos with certain vehicles that I thought deserved it. And there's that brushed aluminum that's probably... Uh, and the steel that's probably best for the Deluxo, as an example. Now, some people might also wonder, but yeah, I'm just uh, it, for those of you that know about it, there's the matte pearlescent trick, and uh, that also works with uh, the uh, metals as well. So that's an interesting note. Another reason why you might want metals unlocked is you can do the matte pearlescent or matte paint job with pearlescent trick or pearlescent on metals, I guess you could say, and you can also do it on chrome as well, just on the topic. All right, that's everything. Let's pop out. <laughs> Park it in a nice light. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully that helps you out. I'm the Missing Sock. We'll see you again next time. Thanks for liking. Thanks for subscribing. We'll see you again soon. Thought that might help out some of you guys. I kind of struggled with the uh, getting the medals for a rally. I thought I kind of needed to get three friends together, and it was proving difficult to get three friends together. I've got good, willing um, participants and crew members, but it's hard to get them all together at the same time when I feel like I'm in the mood for it. <laughs> so, uh, so I thought I'd show you guys this because I just decided to try it on my own, and it worked out really well, really easily, and I hope it does for you guys too. Yes, it does require other people, but uh, if you use criminal records, you'd be surprised how quickly you can go. A lot of times you can launch that race before the other person even understands what's happening with rally, just drive around and you're good <laughs> and if you feel like being nice let them, let them win the next round and uh, they'll have medals too take care everybody see you again soon